Welcome back to AP Precalculus in under three minutes. No time for intros, let's get into it. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. We are at the end of unit two, and I hope you are as happy as me because this unit is a real pain. Luckily, we have an easy one to end it on. So you've been dealing with a certain coordinate plane your entire life, known as the Cartesian plane. The thing is that there is a lot of other planes in math, such as the polar plane, which you and me should both be afraid of coming up at the end of this course. Of course, throughout all of these videos, we've examined the log graphs on a Cartesian plane, but there there's another plane that is used called the semi-log plot. This is a plot that either has the x or y axis logarithmically scaled, while the other axis remains linearly scaled. If the x axis is logarithmically scaled, you'll notice if you graph a log function, it will look linear. If the y axis is logarithmically scaled, you'll notice if we graph an exponential function, it will suddenly look linear. This type of plot can be used to confirm if a function is exponential or logarithmic, so definitely remember which axes correspond to each function. So I hope you're now prepared, because next unit is a total shift on everything you once knew on math. Get ready. For now, on the screen now are some AP style questions for this topic. Pause now. I'll put the work and answers on the screen now. I will see you in the next one.